dropped. It's a hard knock life. It's really hard, especially because people now get into it thinking of money. Oh. And once you get into it thinking of the money is there, it's good. But if that's the only thing that's driving you, you'll get tired. Okay. All right. Guys, slap us with some pictures now. We are ready. We are ready. Slap us with those special effects. And please don't freak out. It's just makeup. So, can I down see down? Don't freak out. Hmm? Hashtag is why in the money. Why does this look so amazing? Oh my gosh. Please walk me through this. Um, that was a what? A face paint cheetah kind of situation. Oh. That was the beginning of my career. Beginning. Like, mm -hmm. Even when I look at it now, I'm like, really? Like, why? <laughs> no, no moka. Anyway. Oh, <laughs> it's not about komoka. It's the growth. Yeah, like, no when you look at your work you back in maybe four or five years ago, and you're like, no, why did I do that? I should have done this instead of doing that. But it's, it's I love seeing my growth, so it's fine. I, I am the presence of great people a lot. Thank you for in the morning, guys. <laughs> And, and every time I hear someone and I say, I could have done better. Like, mm, I'll never end my course there, but I just know you're great. <laughs> I know you're great. Just basically on that. Okay, slap us with another one. Slap us. How long did that take? Just FYI. Um, that took, let's say an hour. Huh? Avatar! Ish. Okay, Avatar people are blue. This yeah. Is green. This is green. This was more like a nature thing. Is that you? No. Some random model. Okay. Um. Just out of curiosity, when someone wants this kind of makeup, like what is what does the phone call sound like? Like, hi, I want to look green and no. nature. No. <laughs> they'll call you. They'll um tell you um I want to do a shoot that entails one to three. Um. Can I know your rates? And I'm like, just send me like a write up mm -hmm. so that I know what exactly it is that I need to do. Because I can give you a quotation that is overpriced and maybe you need something. Or I can give you a quotation that's under and the work that I'm required to do is so much. So I have to first see the scripts, um, read the scripts, then figure out how much product I'm going to use, time, energy, then I'll quote. Again, another sign and symptom of Kuomoka. Give us another picture. Woo! <laughs> oh, and yeah, strength of a woman do you talk well or hashtag is Y N Z money. I'm having fun. Are you having fun? And I'm learning something. Excuse me. Why does that look so real? Like in Ungenu Lisa and Gesamayo in Photoshop, personally. <laughs> Walk me through this. Um, this is optical illusion. Mm -hmm. I like doing a lot of optical illusions. Um, where I'm just using paints mm -hmm. to bring something into life mm -hmm. in form of like 3D. So you look at it and you're thinking, wait, is this real or not? Yeah, <laughs> like I want to peel the thing and <laughs> see what's going on. <laughs> yeah, so I like body paint as well. I do a lot of body painting. So the second picture also was a lot of body painting, the green girl, mm -hmm. and this is also body painting. And this translates into how many hours of work? Um, an hour. Yeah. Sweetie, me the first time I started doing makeup, it took me almost two hours. Just one hour on one eyebrow alone. <laughs> <laughs> and, and she's so efficient that she can do such magic in such a short period of time. Like the more you keep doing it, the shorter the time becomes. So you can, like your eyebrows, you can do it in five minutes even. If you've done it a lot. <laughs> Hashtag is when the morning. Clearly we have a lot to learn. <laughs> Oh, by we, I mean me. <laughs> Hashtag is why the money. Give us another one. Give us another picture. A white five on Facebook. Y254. Woo! That looks so real. Tell me about this. Now that's special effects. Um, yeah, a lot of blood work. Uh -huh. A lot of products use. Actually, not really. Mm -hmm. Um... It needs practice because there's some movies you've seen, Kenyan, Nigerian, mm -hmm. where the wound looks like it's been placed there. So you need to do a lot of practice mm -hmm. so that to make it look as realistic as possible. So you have to study anatomy. That's what we did in school. 
For real? <laughs> yeah, muscles, bones, everything from head to toe. So it we had to know all those all things. That. You had to, like you have to learn them. Because you can't just create a wound. You have to know what muscle is found there. You have to know the bone so that it looks realistic. Because if you have a cut that deep past the muscle, that means a bone will show. So what bone? How is the bone? How far is the bone? Are, are you going to show it? So <sighs> yes, it's <You're> fine. So <laughs> yeah. I, I started off impressed, but now I'm just, I don't even know what. Like she's a <laughs> scientist, basically. Eh, OK. Do you have another picture? <laughs> this is getting interesting. <laughs> Hashtag is why in the morning. This is an aging photo. Yeah. This is the same person. Mm -hmm. OK, walk me through this process now. So this is the uh, aging. Um, gig I was telling you I did last year mm -hmm. where I had to age mm -hmm. like 60 people <sighs> it was difficult but it, it happened <laughs> I like how you're so composed <laughs> I can't even imagine <laughs> what was going on uh -huh. no because it was just um, there's a lot of so many things went wrong let me just put it like that so many things went wrong because mm -hmm. um, the products I was supposed to use they were coming from the States and then someone forgot them there so I had to <gasps> improvise and yeah. Well, look at you doing <laughs> such a good job. Okay, okay, another one, another one. Like DJ Khaled, hashtag is why in the morning. And before we leave, of course, you are going to tell me about your product line. Okay. Okay, just tell me about it now. Even. Um, I decided to start this product line <coughs> because of product and availability in Kenya. Mm -hmm. For me, I have to order my things on Amazon because we can't find them in Africa. Let me just put it like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and even if you do, they are overpriced. So I usually just have to ship in my products. So I just decided, OK. So people keep asking me, do you have this? Do you have that? And I'm like, I don't. I have to ship. I just said, oh, wait, I can actually start my own thing make my own blood, sell it. So that's how I started making my own blood, selling it. Um, shipped in a lot of silicone and just repackaged and started selling. So that actually helps people who are in the industry um, get access to products easily. So it's all about just trial and error. <laughs> Guys, are you as impressed? <laughs> As I am, like, not only does she know what she's doing, she actually knows the human body. Like, she's in intricately involved with her passion. And not just that, she now also provides products so that people in the industry can thrive. Just wait. Uh, <coughs> these presidential awards, who are they given to? Can we give her one? Excuse mm -hmm. me, Mr. President, good morning. I know you watch the show, and, and we are glad. But we, we would like you to honor her in some type of way. I, by we, again, I mean me. I'd like you to, and I mean it, by the way. OK, move mm -hmm. Georgia for a living, clearly. <laughs> but I, I, I really do mean it. Like, I'm <laughs> like I feel now like I want to start my own station and just start <laughs> another media house and I start funny evil bassy to chase evil. Okay. And now has COVID nineteen affected your craft? Um and how? It has because of filming. We have to film like if you shoot in a movie or a TVC or um so the works were not coming in because again the curfew and everything so yeah it did affect even in the in terms of the school um most of my students are kids who still live with their parents so they're told yeah matatu, mm -hmm. kuna matatu. so mm -hmm. they're like i want to come but my mom says i'm like it's okay let's just wait for covid to die mm -hmm. whenever it is it will die and then you can pick it up from there what does being your student mean? Is it rigorous? Like, do I have to be there every day, Monday to Monday? No, it's um, Monday to Wednesday, but the days are flexible. I, it's three times a, a week. So whichever day you choose, which is not the weekend, <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> um, yes, Monday to Wednesday, um, five hours. 
So it's not like at your whole day thing where you have to nine to five, no. So we start at eight, by one you're done. Um, it's, it's flexible, really. So if you're available on Friday, we can do Friday. If you're available on Thursday, we can do it on Thursday, Monday, so yeah. Does it involve also learning anatomy or is it just, you know? Just no, it's the basics mm -hmm. because I tried to, <sighs> I tried to teach like everything that I felt people should know. But then if you put that in terms of the fee, Kenyans being Kenyans. Ah, we like free things. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So I just told myself, okay, let me just compress everything and just teach the basics that if you're called on set, the way that things, because Kenya people also don't like thinking too far, they'll call you for a cut, a bruise, gunshot wound, aging, you know, mm -hmm. those things. So I'm just like, okay. So those are the basics that I teach. Imagine if you were in Nigeria and then someone has been shot in the head, but they're still moving. <laughs> <laughs> How much money would we make? A lot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we have a couple of more pictures uh, ready and set. So slap me with another one. Slap us. Wow. What is that? Um, that was... It was more of beauty makeup. Mm -hmm. I did a collaboration with my friend. Mm -hmm. She does jewelry. So she's the one who did the headpiece. And then I did the makeup and the chest situation. Yeah. yeah. I'll pay everything. Okay. okay. Yeah, I support black people. <laughs> and supporting black people does not mean calling them for job and then asking them for discount. Are we together? Thanks. Hashtag is why the money. Okay, slap us with another one. Another one. Another one. Give us hashtag is why in the money. Remember, we also have a conversation going at what by phone. Okay? Facebook. Aha. Uh -huh. Same person, right? Because I can no. see the headpiece. The headpiece, no. I made that headpiece. What? <laughs> I made the headpiece. And then um this was actually a personal project for the for this client uh -huh. she just wanted something she wanted the headpiece but then in terms of the makeup she wanted something very neutral so that's why i went with that it looks amazing <gasps> i want to ask a question but first walk me through the process here mm -hmm. mm. that one was uh for gender-based violence mm -hmm. uh, yeah it was just to bring awareness to that that's how I ended up doing the cut and the bruise. Why these particular areas? Because I can see she's bleeding over here a little bit on her nose. She has a black eye. Why these particular areas? Um, if your husband hates you, mm -hmm. <laughs> that's you mean. You'll have a black eye, mm -hmm. your nose is bleeding, your mouth. So those are just the basic areas where people bleed, I think, when they are <laughs> in a domestic violence situation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Have you ever used makeup to get yourself out of something? Makeup? Never. Never I would so do it. See, this is why God does not give you talents that you're not supposed I've to have. I've had those. I've had someone tell me, oh, can you come do for me makeup? I want to prank my boyfriend. And I'm like, yo. Or I want to say, oh, he hit me. And I'm like, okay. Prank? Yeah. I'm like. <laughs> okay. Listen. Please, eh? We, we can't be joking about these things because when it actually happens, no one is going to believe us. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm thinking, okay, employer, don't come for me, but that's basically what I was thinking about. Like, I don't want to go to work, do something, so I can take a picture. Mm. But frankly, talk about your boyfriend hit you and he didn't. What's wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Now, you will be the one crying wolf, and third time, ain't nobody coming to help you. But anyway, hashtag is why in the morning. In your other life, would you pick something else to do? Would you be a lawyer? Would you be a doctor? Never. Why? I can't believe that. What inspired you? Like, what one thing caught you? Did you read a book? Did you watch a movie? Did I watched um, a series. Which one? Two of them. Um, Grey's Anatomy. Yes. Uh -huh. And Dexter. Hey, Dexter is a bit freaky for me. Yeah. Whoa. I love text. I think I watched it like three times. I was like, yeah, I really want to know how to do these <laughs> things. And that's how I decided, okay, I think that's something I can add on to makeup, mm -hmm. to use my makeup. <laughs> Post-COVID, where do you see yourself? 
Um, I, I would have said open a bigger place, but I've already done that Whoa. during Corona. <laughs> so I just want to see my school grow. Um, I want to have like a warehouse where I can create monsters and zombies and all those freaky things. That sounds so cool, bro. I know. I'm a little bit scary, but very, very cool. Mm -hmm. Do you have a target audience? Like your school is for teenagers or people on campus or is it just open for everyone? I thought I had like a target audience, but <laughs> I'm getting everyone. Next month I have a, a student who's 14. Wow. Yeah. The dad just called me like, yo, my kid really loves these things. Can I'm like, cool, sure. <laughs> and then I have campus people. I have people who are out of campus, people who are even in 